A front runner has emerged to fill the great conservative thinker Antonin Scalia's seat on the Supreme Court. Neil Gorsuch is a highly regarded conservative judge well known for defending gun rights and religious liberty. He currently serves on the 10th Circuit Court of Appeals in Denver. He consistently says he decides cases based off of the original and intended meaning of the Constitution. That is exactly what Scalia did. Judge Gorsuch would be a welcome addition to the Supreme Court by any freedom and gun-loving American. The president has been swift to act on his campaign promises with a slew of executive orders aimed at making America great again. Well, the president is set to sign an executive order today to make America safe again. President Trump is expected to issue that executive order that temporarily bans most refugees and suspends visas for citizens of Syria and six other Middle Eastern and African countries. This is about our national security. You watch, the left will freak out. The media will call Donald Trump racist. They have no idea the people fleeing these dangerous terror infected countries just can't be vetted. One terrorist slipping into America could kill thousands here. When will liberals wake up to the fact that we are at war with jihadists who want to eradicate us from the earth? The safety and security of this nation must always be the president's top priority. The ban on refugees from these Muslim terror-torn countries cannot come soon enough. In fact, a commentator video by Dom Rosso paints a grim picture of ISIS sneaking in with a nuclear warhead into America. He reveals proof that ISIS wants to do this. In ISIS's own magazine, it spells out the scenario of buying off a corrupt Pakistani official to purchase a nuclear bomb. Then they pay off the cartels of outside the southern border of Mexico and the United States to help sneak that nuclear weapon into America. It is a scenario top Pentagon officials have not ruled out. The mainstream media refuses to port a report on the frightening prospect, not us. Knowledge means power, and power means safety.